New tonight, a Charlotte couple is celebrating a hobby that grew into a side hustle that COVID helped turn into a hugely popular growing business. WCNC Charlotte's Michelle Bowden has a story of how Babe and Butcher figured out where's the money. They started two years ago just on Instagram. They grew so fast and so much. Now they have their own storefront and they're looking to expand. She's the babe, he's the butcher. And which cheeses? You get three. Together, they're Babe and Butcher, the fast-growing charcuterie business that started catering events and recently grew to have their own storefront at Camp North End. I mean, we thought it would be a weekend hustle, you know. <laughs> um, I had a two-seater convertible and thought that once in a while I would deliver a cheese board and a month later we had to get an SUV. The babe, Lindsay Anvik, has a marketing background and started posting her artful creations on Instagram. Uh, social media was an unbelievable force for us, for sure. So we were super lucky to have people just gravitate towards it. The business kept getting bigger with their cheesy creations in high demand at events and parties until COVID hit. So during COVID, you know, no one could have boards. We couldn't gather. So we decided to figure out how to pivot. And so we made little boxes we could deliver. Um, and we weren't sure if people would like them, if it would take off, but it took off in a way that we thought maybe this is something. What kind of cheese would you like? They realized people liked customizing their boxes. And then you get five compliments. People wanted it the, exactly the way they wanted it. Extra olives, you know, more pickles, you know, uh, a lot more cheese. So we thought it would be fun for people to come in and make it like they would a sub or a pizza or anything like that, but for charcuterie, because we'd never heard of anything like that before. They opened in Camp North End just a few months ago and have been so successful, they're already looking at what's next. They say one of the things that's really helped them partnering with other small businesses across the Charlotte community. Reporting in Charlotte, Michelle Bowden, WCNC Charlotte. I can tell you they make a great product too. Mm, yum. <laughs>